So, good morning. Welcome to online BSA. I think we made, we changed the program this time and I talk in German. <laughs> no, it's a joke. <laughs> we are start to talk about all steel clamps, the high performance clamps. And you see, I have here a small range of our all steel clamps. The all steel clamps is, you see it in the image movie, it's called drawing here by Bessé. Here in this part of metal, we are heating this so more or less 900 or 1000 degrees. And here it's bending and forge the pressure plate. And after structural relaxing and made galvanic and so and so and so, and then it's finished the clamp. We are heating, this metal is heating um, and harding. And we hard the same, the movable jaw and the rail, the profile rail, it's the same harding. And then we are talking about the spindle. The spindle you see, the spindle is it's not it's not cutting, it's rolled, it's a rolled spindle. The surface is a little bit stronger and harder. You see here the whole range, there is not a plastic handle, is not um, a wood handle, it's only this a Tommy bar. The Tommy bar it's easier for the metal worker when they have oil or other things on their hands, and then it's very easy to, to close the clamp and it turned the spindle with the Tommy bar. It's very easy. And now you see, and now I talk about the pressure blade. You see here the pressure blade, it's different. I have here, the name is GZ, here, SL, GL, STB, and here my fat lady is STPS. And we have clamping force for more or less 500 kilo, 850 kilo clamping force, 1,200 kilo clamping force, 2,200 kilo clamping force, and the very strong, very biggest clamping force is here 3.5 ton. And the difference is, you see here, the spindle, and here the spindle is very different. There's different spindle, it's, they have more force, have more power with this spindle. You see here, a uh, six edge here on the end from the, from the spindle. Here is a six edge here and here on the STBS is a six edge too. Then you can here work with a wrench, more power, or here with the STBS, you can lengthen the Tommy bar with a pipe. You can stick a pipe of this and then you have more power to close the clamp. Here in the, the special, the special of the high performance clamps is inside the pressure blade. I opened the pressure blade for you. But in the real life, you cannot open the pressure blade. The pressure blade is close to more or less than 35 newton meters. You cannot open this. So look at this, look at this. This is the, the blade, pressure blade here. So the ball head and the screw. You see the difference? We have here a special cinder steel inside. This is a cinder steel. This is hard metal. There is inside the pressure plate. The ball head works very hard with the high pressure, works hard in this yeah, cinder steel and the cinder steel not damaged the ball head. And this is for long leaf and yeah, stay very longer. For example, when you, when you use a high performance plant, and you close the high performance, then maybe I do it in front, and can you see it better? So, you twist the spindle. And when you turn the spindle, the pressure blade stays stable on the surface 
from the metal or other things. And when it's the ball head, ball head inside it's damaged, you turn the spindle and you turn on the same way the pressure plate. And then it's damaged the surface and you become or you get not the, the, high, the high clamping force. You not become uh, you not to get the high the high force for the high performance clamp. You see here the high performance clamp. You have the movable. It's very easy to to work with this, with that also. So I close this pressure plate. Okay. <laughs> And it's very easy. You can you can buy a other pressure plate when it's when it's damaged inside, for example, and then you can can buy in the spare part a new pressure plate. And it's very easy. There's here, uh, yeah, and Steve. So a pin, yeah, it's a pin inside. You heat it out. This pin, do out the the broken the broken pressure plate. Do it inside in the in the plastic, in the plastic pad, in the plastic of the uh, spare part is a new pin, and then you can do it inside and heat it, and the pressure blade is finished. It's a new, and you have changed it. Now I talk about the STBS. You see, the STBS is complete, a little bit different to the other. They have here uh, a cordon. When you work with the no, with the other high performance lamp, you can move the 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 mover the, the mover the jaw. Here is very different. It's very high weight, and you cannot do the same. Move with the movable jaw and and then close the clamp. You you adjust. The, the movable jaw, and then you heat it with the hammer, made it fix the movable, and now it's the movable is fixed, and then you can close the, the spindle, and you get the force, three ton, five tons of clamping force of the STBS. We have different lengths different sides of the rail, so more or less to until one and a half meter. The big one is only for one meter, and the other have different lengths, different sizes of the of the rail. You see the, the page, you see the pressure plate with the cinder steel, and you see this small YouTube button. And then you can look it to the YouTube channel for special movies. We made it. You can see we changed the pressure blade, the different the different sizes or other things what you want to do with the high performance clamps.
So, I'll be back. You see here a range of old steel clamps. And I will talk about the handles, the different handles we have. We have it on the, yeah. The, the first is the wood handle with colored. The next one is the 2K, the plastic handle. Here you know it, the Tommy bar. The lever handle. And the new one is the plastic handle. And when you use it, you twist the handle, you twist, twist, and you lost the power in the hand. You can, this is a swivel handle. You can click it 360 degrees. You can turn it. It's, it's, it's over the, it's over the rail, over the, the profile rail. You can turn it 360 degrees. It's very easy. 500 kilo clamping force and Turn it very easy around the spindle and it's not stop on the profile rail. So, and now I talk a little bit about the lever, the lever hand, the lever clamp. So, the lever clamp is working inside this pressure plate. You see here the black metal is cinder steel inside the same it's hard metal inside there's inside here when the, the lever is working the cinder steel is not grinding inside and the stay of a lot for a long time and and it's very very easy to work with this and stay a long time and this and this um, is for protect and safe when you work with in the, in the metal with vibration, you grinding, you sawing, or make other, and you have vibrations on the material. And look at I close a norm a normal screw clamp. You see it when I close a normal screw clamp. I need a lot of time, and now it's fixed. And here the lever. It's five times faster than a screw clamp. And when you have vibration on the material, the lever it's not goes not open. And when you when you when you work right with this, please the lever a little bit back, push back, and then you can open this the the brake, and then it's very easy open not hit here with a hammer and when you when you hit here with the, with the hammer it's no problem there's spring open it's, it's, it's go open but in five or six time it's damaged the small teeth here we have here so small teeth and then it's damaged this part of this and part of this button and when you then when you want to close it's not holding it's, it's complete spring up. It's not holding the lever, and it's damaged the complete, the complete uh, uh, clamp. Or maybe, for example, they have here so a little bit damaged the the collar, the surface, and the the craftsman, the metal worker, close this maybe lengthen with a pipe, stick here pipe on the lever, close, and for example, it's broken here or broke the tears or other things it's it's not good for the for the clamp when you work with hand with normal working with this clamp it's very long very long lift this is a good clamp for the vibrations we have other clamp for the vibrations you can use this for vibrations but the better the best is the lever inch or the, the lever the lever clamp from this here, this bow, this is special. And when you work with this clamp, and then comes vibrations on the metal or other things, the vibrations goes in the bow, and the spindle is not twist open. But when you want 
a good, very good clamp for the vibrations, use the lever clamp. Oh. So, and now we talk about other glands, special glands. We have U clamp, claw clamp, grip plier. So, and I begin with the U clamp. U clamp looks like this. You see, it's a different clamp than the normal all steel clamp. We have here so U form, and the special is for the U form. And now you are repair or build truck trailers and maybe halls with very big or the bigger, very big T-beans, double T-beans or other metals. And then, for example, do you need to fix the other pipe inside the double T-bean? And then do one you use a normal. And and you want to fix here, you need other piece of metal or you need the colleague and it's, it's not comfortable. It's not comfortable to clamp and not comfortable to work. And now, we do it here with the U-clamp. Close the U-clamp. So, you see this? And now, it's fixed inside double tp you not need other piece of metal or for example other piece of wood you not need or other colleague to to help to hold and we have in the catalog three sizes three big sizes of the u clamp you see it and the, uh, yeah the craftsman the metal worker need this size of the U in the catalog you see uh, yeah a U clamp and you see, see the dimension maybe for example this is six centimeters is a 16 millimeters the next is 100 you have different handles with Tommy bar with lever handle and and the one they have in the end of the spindle is a six edge for a rudge. You can use a rudge when you have no power in the in the arm. You can close it stronger. And it's very yeah, it's a special clamp for metal worker with double T bean, T bean, or other forms for truck trailers, truck repair, or other things. So, 
then I talk about my special clamp. I very like the clock lamp. You see here the different, you have here the profile rail, you have here the sliding arm. And when you, when you look on the other all steel clamp, there is here the profile rail and you have on this side have the spindle. And this is the benefit, you have here not a spindle. And then I will show you the special. So, for example, you can here fix it very easy. And when you hear welding, uh, do or grinding or do other thing, it's not dirty or not with the welding bubbles on the spindle. And it's very easy to turn. And then we do have to so more or less 800 kilo clamping force. Here on the on the pressure plate is a V groove. You can see the V groove, and then you can fix a pipe, for example. And now comes the special. I would like to fix this, this pipe here inside, and then you want to go to fix it with a clamp. It's not possible. The spindle is in the space. And now here, you go out of the material or the metal, and you can go inside and fix it with 800 kilo clamping force. And you see here, you have a lot of space to working. There's not a spindle in the space. Or for example, the next one is, you can go inside the pipes. Look at this. And then you have a lot of space for your work, for welding, grinding, drilling. You can do a lot of with this clamp. And now I come to the next special of this clamp. You see here on the back side, on the back side, the rail is a screw. There's a screw and then you can open, you can open the screw. So like this. And in this position, you can clamp and now push out. So, and now you can spread, but not really. You need a accessory like this GR, GTR, no, GRR, GTR, or oh, forget the name, sorry. There's three screws here. Do it here on the pressure plate and close the screws. So, and fix it with the screw driver. So, so, and now, and now you can spread. You see on the page the accessory to spread. And when you finish with your work, you need spread throughout this. Turn back the movable jaw. Drill inside. So the screw inside and everything is fine. And then you have finished clog lamp. Clog lamp for metal is my favorite clamp. You can do a lot of with the clamp. You cannot do this with this clamp. You can do it a lot of, and you have very high force, 800 kilo clamping force. When you have any questions about the clamps, you can write it in the chat, yes, and Robert will, will ask you. Yes, you're right. 
So, and now last one, we have a range of grip players with a grip player of pipe, a normal grip player, and like a C-clamp grip player. And now I will show you for what you need this. This C grip player, you see it is self-adjust about this rail. You have here screw for the angle, can you change a little bit? And here, can you change a little bit the force? But you not not need to change anywhere. It's everything okay. It's good. Adjust. So, and the C clamp is a small point to fix it. And then you can fix it. Maybe for example, when you repair your trailers, trucks, and you need a little bit welding or screwing, or when you have problem you cannot fix here on this side you can fix it inside better you see it's like a C clamp maybe likes a U clamp open it's very easy the C clamp the next one is uh, the normal clamp is self-adjusting too you see it it's closed and now you can fix like this, it's closed. I have here on the blade, it's plastic, it's protect, it's protect the surface and protect for stainless steel. When you need to weld stainless steel, you need this plastic protect. You can you can weld complete with inox and stainless steel with the blood, but not neighbor the plastic pads. The plastic pads is a little bit good. They, they can have a little bit uh, uh, temperation, but not directly welding neighbor this. And when you do out the protector, you can make, or you can fix very easy. Uh, we, we tell it um, the black steel, and the other is the stainless steel. I have here a small V groove here. It's for fixing or the fix of pipes. You can fix the pipe. And uh, the last grip player is the grip player for pipes. Like this. Here is the same self adjust. You can small pipes, you can big pipes. And for this is you can do two pieces of pipes together and not when, when the pipes is in the, the, the pipe clear, uh, clear, not welding complete. Only made a, power, uh, a welding point here, welding point here, or for example, welding point here, and then do out, do out the pipe and then you can welding complete finish. Not not complete finish welding in the pipe clear. clear. Then, the, then you damaged the plastic protector. And it's the same here. You can the black pipe without the plastic protector. And with uh, stainless steel, you need to protect it with the plastic. And then is the stainless steel is not contaminated of this special surface.
So, I am back to the last yeah, session. We have here SGVAD, SGGLAMP. Here the VAD is on the clamp assembly. Ass uh, yes, assembly. And here have, we have on the Tommy bar, this is a special plastic protector. It's more comfortable when you close and when you turn with the hand, it's more comfortable. And you see, you can slide the Tommy bar. So, and the special of the clamp is you can fix very easy round things like this. Not move out the pipe. Or you can fix special forms. So, for example, this. Close. And now you can start to welding here for the special form. So, the next special for this clamp is we have here a screw too. You can open the screw like this. Do out the sliding arm, turn it, do it back. And here, with a hexagon, you can turn this, the VAD on the other side. And I have support. And then they look like this. And you can, in this form, I will turn back the screw and close the rail. So you see the page for this variable clamp. And in this clamp, you can fix and clamp. And here, when it's in this position, you can spread. You see it. The next one is you can fix it out, out of the pipes. See it here? Out of the pipes and the outside. Or you can fix it in, in the pipe. Here. You see it? It's a very variable clamp to weld and work with pipes. But this tool is only one size. They have no other size of the rails, it's only one size. You see it for clamping and spreading, and you see it's one size of the clamp. So. When you have not this as G V A D, maybe you, for example, you have a other a normal clamp, a normal all steel clamp like this, and then you can buy a special adapter in for accessories V A D. There is two pieces inside, and it's. It's like the same, you can fix it like this, or fix it like this. And it's very easy to assemble inside. It's a you know, hexagon key. Do it here, for example, on the, on the pressure plate from the old steel clamp. You can fix this accessory on the old steel clamp or the label iron coast clamp. And now it's the same. You can fix round materials or special forms like this. Or you can assembly this VAD on both sides from the pressure blades.
So. And then you can fix a lot of more. Just one, one moment. <laughs> Ah, I do it like in last time like this. So and then is like this and like this. So so no, it's working. Super. You see, You can, can do a lot of with this VAD, with special forms, round forms. Oh, that's wrong. And when you finish, do it back in the pocket. And then you have the, you all still clamp back. So. And now I will talk about the last clamp, the special clamp, this SLV. The special of the SLV is we have only a rail, a profile rail, that's in the real life is it one meter, one half meter, or two meters. You see, there is one rail and two movable jaws here, and we have here two screws for open the rail and then you can change this clamp for clamping to spreading it's very easy spreading or maybe you can buy a lot of other movable drawers so you can do it here and first for clamping here the next one inside this inside here inside and then you can welding fix the clamp here and here made across and then you can weld across when you when you want maybe for example you have a hole in the wall you can do it outside the house the wall and then close the clamp and then you can fix it outside outside for example a wood panel or other things for repair the house for repair the whole, uh, the, the wall and you can do other um, movable inside here you can use it with the wood handle or when you know when you want here with the lever so when you have vibrations it's better to use the lever handle and this is a very good tool and a variable tool you can do a lot of special forms. Maybe you can do two here on this side. You can do here two. And then you can fix on this side and hold on this side or the other way. It's a very variable clamp. SLV. One meter, one half meter and two meters, the rail, the profile rail. And you can, in, in the accessories, in the spare part, you can buy a lot of different things about this clamp. So, when you have questions, tell Robert, you can write Robert. Uh, when you want, you can see this movie on the this training can you see on the YouTube channel next week so for example and 
you can see on YouTube a lot of other movies about our tools. You can see we use, you use the, the clams. Instagram, we have a lot of, of Instagram. And when you want, please show again the big image movie. We have show you the small image movie. The big, big image movie is more interesting. And then you can look on YouTube, Instagram, and you find a lot of. So for this time, I say thank you for your time. Maybe we see you soon in another training hour.